Well, if you don't see the problem, a Verona company will show it to you. Driving under the influence of drugs, marijuana is joining alcohol on our highways. And as marijuana is legalized by more states, the problem is expected to grow. Tonight, only on News 3, reporter Dave Delosier shows us what it's like to be impaired by marijuana. Yeah, and just... And we just try to make it engaging and provide an experience that people may relate to. You ready? Ready. All right. What appears to be a game here is one you don't want to play out here. Common sense might say that it's probably not a good idea to be under the influence of any substance and behind the wheel of a car. Which brings us back to this. It's simple. Three colored balls. Catch the black ones and avoid the orange and red. Simple, right? All right. Very good. But when you put these on... This time, we're going to have you wear the, the Fail Vision Marijuana Goggle. It's not so easy, and your ability to make decisions is slowed. I have a hard time making that decision. I catch it either too late or else I ca caught the wrong one. The information's not slowing down, just your ability to process it. Inacorp, a Verona-based company, has spent two years developing the Fatal Vision Marijuana Goggle. We are working with experts in the field, drug recognition experts, to try and understand what the consequences of recreational marijuana uh, consumption might be. Just released two weeks ago, the hope is schools and law enforcement agencies can use this to teach through engagement. And they will ask you questions. So instead of doing a push of information, you get to do a pull because they'll ask you, well, what about this and what about that? And you get a better chance of getting that lesson driven home on their terms. Because it's one thing to be told about drug driving and another to see it. When you're trying to be on the cutting edge, trying to meet the challenges and who knows how many lives we're going to save. See how you did. In Verona, this is Dave Delosier, WISC News 3. So, And here they are. These are the goggles, and they really make it difficult to read a teleprompter. Also, <laughs> make it difficult to color and process information. They look good on you. Oh, oh yeah, you definitely look. cannot You don't want to go skiing in those goggles. Yeah, you can't read the prompter, so I should... These, yeah, you yeah. want to put those away. Yeah, experts say that difficulty processing information is a key characteristic of marijuana impairment, and it is that slowing in processing information that can lead to accidents on the road. And if that's how it is, yeah. then pretty remarkable pretty technology. Hard. And a Verona company just patented this, so pretty big breakthrough there yeah. in helping law enforcement.